Hi, we're standing in the sacristy. Kind of looks like a kitchen, doesn't it? Actually, we can call it the kitchen of the church. Because in this room, just like in your kitchen, we get ready for celebrations. We have all the things we need to celebrate the second part of the Mass, called the Liturgy of the Eucharist, and to celebrate all the sacraments. Let's look at some of these things. Let's get started. These are corporals. They are placemats. Father will lay them on the altar and put the chalice and hosts on the corporals during the liturgy of the Eucharist. This is the chalice. A chalice is a special cup that holds the wine and a drop of water during the consecration. The cruets hold that wine and water. The purificator is just like a napkin that we use at dinner. The priest uses it to wipe the chalice. This plate is called a paten. A large host is placed on the paten. During the consecration, with the help of the Holy Spirit, the priest blesses the host and the wine. Even though the host and wine look and taste the same, we know the host and wine became the body and blood of Christ. And we say, Amen. I believe. I believe Jesus is with us in a special way. After the host is blessed, we call it the Eucharist. A ciborium is a dish that holds the consecrated hosts, holds the body of Christ. People will receive the body of Christ during the communion part of the Mass. Lastly, here are two pitchers. Father uses the water in the first pitcher to wash his hands before sharing the Eucharist with us. The water in the second pitcher is used to purify or wash the vessels at the end of our celebration. The altar reminds us of the table where Jesus sat on Holy Thursday and said the very first Mass. He looked at his apostles and said, do this in memory of me. Every time Father David says the Mass, he is following Jesus' command to do this in memory of me. And we, like the apostles, come to pray, to receive graces, and to show our love for Jesus every time we come to Mass.